Today our topic is on ventilators. We discuss in this video, ventilator in details, and also, phases of ventilator. Ventilator circuit design. Ventilator alarms. If you are new on my channel please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thanks. Ventilator Ventilator are used extensively in the operating room and intensive care unit. All modern anesthesia machine are equipped with a ventilator. Overview Ventilators generates gas flow by creating a pressure gradient between the proximal airway and the alveoli. Ventilator function is best described in relation to four phases of ventilator cycle. Inspiration The transition from inspiration to expiration. Expiration And the transition from expiration to inspiration. Other classification categories may include Power source Control mechanism. Inspiratory phase. During inspiration, ventilator generate tidal volume by producing gas flow along a pressure gradient. The machine generate either a constant pressure or constant gas flow rate. Transition phase from inspiration to expiration. Termination of the inspiratory phase can be triggered by a preset limit of time. A set inspiratory pressure that must be reached, or predetermined tidal volume that must be delivered. Expiratory phase The expiratory phase of ventilator normally reduces airway pressure to atmospheric level or some preset value of positive end expiratory pressure. Flow out of the lung is determined primarily by airway resistance and lung compliance. Transition from expiration to inspiration. Transition into the next inspiratory phase may be based on a preset time interval or a change in pressure. The behavior of the ventilator during this phase together with the type of cycling from inspiration to expiration determines ventilator mode. During control ventilation, the most basic mode of all ventilators, the next breath always occurs after a preset time interval. Thus tidal volume and rate are fixed in volume controlled ventilation. Ventilator circuit design Traditionally ventilators on anesthesia machine have a double circuit system design and or pneumatically powered and electronically controlled. Double circuit system ventilators. In a double circuit system design, tidal volume is delivered from a bellow assembly that consists of a bellows in a clear rigid plastic enclosure. Piston ventilator. In a piston design, the ventilator substitute an electrically driven piston for the bellows. The ventilators requires either minimal or no pneumatic power. The major advantage of piston ventilator is its ability to deliver accurate tidal volume to patient with very poor lung compliance and to very small patients. Spill valve. Whenever a ventilator is used on an anesthesia machine, the circle system APL valve must be functionally removed or isolated from the circuit. A bag or ventilator switch typically accomplishes this. Ventilator alarms. Alarms are an integral part of all modern anesthesia ventilators. Whenever a ventilator is used, disconnect alarms must be passively activated. Anesthesia workstations should have at least three disconnect alarms. Low peak inspiratory pressure. Low exhalat tidal volume. Low exhalat carbon dioxide. Thanks for watching. 
Anesthesia with Dr. T. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thanks.